I am so happy to be with you today and announce the ninth president of Aquinas College. You know, as we reflect back over the last few months, there was a lot of hard work that was put into this by many people to bring us to this specific day. The first one that I'd like to thank is our interim president, Dr. Steve Jermick, was right there when the board asked him if he would step in and lead this charge. And I have to tell you, the board had tremendous respect for him going into this, but it only grew throughout this process. His transparency and collaboration really helped bring this Aquinas community to get together so that we could have a successful search. In addition to that, I'm really proud and grateful of my board colleagues, Sam Cummings and John Lowry, who led the charge and co-chaired the search committee for this process. They did a beautiful job of the skill and also they had tremendous intentionality in putting together not only the search committee, but the whole process. And as that process got underway, we were looking specifically for a Catholic leader who had successful experience in higher education. And that's exactly what we found. Now, it's no coincidence, I don't believe, that this whole process and the majority of it took place during the season of Lent. As Catholics, we know that on Easter Sunday, we are different people than who we were on Ash Wednesday when the process begins. It changed many of us during that time, but also as a community, I think we also really grew during that Lenten season. And it's with that time that we were able to not only interview candidates, but bring four of the finalists on campus for in-person interviews. Those interviews took place with faculty, staff, students, um, other constituents, alumni. And then we had an open forum where all of our community could meet face-to-face -face or on Zoom if they were around the world, each of these finalist candidates. And we took that consideration and that feedback very seriously from that group. The board then met in a special board meeting on April 22nd where we did select the final candidate. I am so pleased to introduce and welcome to you the ninth president of Aquinas College, Dr. Alicia Cordoba. Alicia most recently comes to us from St. Mary's University in San Antonio, Texas, where she started the Center for Catholic Studies. Before that, she was at Benedictine University in Illinois, where she had several leadership roles in mission and integration, as well as the head of Department of Music, which is another passion of hers. She, her degrees are from the University of Illinois and also from the Juilliard School, which bring great um, and wonderful depth to our liberal arts education. I have to tell you that the day that we offered Alicia the job, I had the privilege of calling her and right after the board meeting offered her the position and we had a wonderful discussion. She accepted the job, but one of the things she said at the very end was, I am going to work so hard to be your next best college president. And she said, wait, not your next best, our next best college president. It is my pleasure to introduce and welcome Dr. Alicia Cordoba our next president of Aquinas College.